5.5 IELTS, each band, and 58% in uh, plus two from Nepal, 40 lakh balance in SBI bank, and income source of 20 lakh uh, per year. Is he eligible to for New Zealand? Or IELTS, same salarial law, because uh, at 5.5, you will struggle to get into uh, the right level of course. And unless and until you get into the right level of course, you will not be able to get the right level of uh, work visa. Just coming up to the uh, NZQA table of uh, eligibility at 5.5 uh, you will not be doing very very well uh, because at 5.5 you would uh, to get into a level 7 uh, and above you need an academic score of 6 with no band score lower than 5.5 so at your 5.5 you are only looking at possibly a diploma at level five and that diploma at level five uh, well if you do a course uh, which is four and five and five and six uh, for at least 60 weeks or two years is when you would be eligible for the post study uh, uh, you know the work visa the new work rights that have been uh, declared which is for you know uh, three years uh, 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 sorry, if you study uh, uh, a qualification at level five, four to six, and for minimum 60 weeks, and if you study outside Auckland, then you would be eligible for a uh, two year uh, open uh, post study work visa. If you study uh, a four to six level for two years, and if you if it's in Auckland, then you will get a one year. So, and likewise, uh, ideally, if you want to get into a three year get want to get a three years post study work visa then ideally it might be a good idea for you to join the bachelor's because the bachelor's uh, will definitely provide you with a three year post study work visa so your english seems to be a bit of an issue at the moment you might want to address that uh, aspect and then based on that you can take a call whether you can want to do a bachelor's or you want to do a level four to six uh, outside Auckland so that you can get at least a two-year work visa so with your situation there are a lot of permutations and combinations so we will need to assess and address uh, and uh, understand what is the best solution for us